Among the most popular, um, or at least most widely discussed practices of the Healing Tao system is the, the aspect of Taoist sexology. And in this video here, I, I want to talk about men's health, and I want to share a little bit about um, not only my experience with the practice, but uh, some of the, the benefits, an overview of the practice, and um, a small amount on uh, working with a partner uh, for men that are in a relationship. So the, the big picture here, the major overview is that we're transforming this powerful sexual energy into um, emotional virtue, physical strength, mental intelligence, and spiritual growth. So inside every ejaculation that a man has, there's somewhere around 500 million sperm or something like that. Each one of those has the power to create a life. And as the as a man is getting close to reaching an orgasm, this the best energy that the body has, the energy is saying, okay, we're gonna create a baby. Let's send all the best energy that we have to the sperm. It starts getting excited, starts swimming fast. And whenever the ejaculation happens, then all of that um, goes into having a baby. Um, or, you know, if there's birth control, it doesn't do that. But what this practice is about is harnessing all that powerful energy and using it in the ways that I mentioned earlier for uh, increased intelligence, spiritual growth, positive emotions, and um, physical strength and mental intelligence. And so this can be practiced with, uh, with a partner, without a partner. Uh, it's called solo cultivation when you practice it by yourself and dual cultivation if you're practicing with a partner. Um, I, I recommend and my teachers recommend you work with the solo cultivation by yourself, building up that energy, learning different ways to approach it um, before you try to do anything with a partner. At the time, the, the type of practice to do with a partner is just the inner smile, just relaxing um, and enjoying yourself. Not, not getting too mental at all with any of it, but especially not with a partner. The extent that you'll feel this energy and be able to share it uh, with a partner relies totally on your ability to open up your channels to feel this energy um, in yourself during your solo practice. Um, so some of the benefits that you can um, expect when you're practicing this, um, enhanced sexual enjoyment, um, increased lasting power, um, more energy uh, in your sexual organs by building up that energy, uh, you'll feel more organs, It'll um, you'll start to see in your face, like in the energy of your face, your skin, um, you can notice a softer color, you can notice um, even a more relaxed demeanor about you. Uh, you can gain awareness and conscious control over your sexual energy. So rather than something that's uh, driving you all over town, so to speak, or driving your thoughts uh, everywhere, you can start to make friends with this sexual energy that's so powerful and start to direct it um, into the channels, uh, the energy channels, whether that's um, the 12 acupressure meridians that we've talked about or through the eight extraordinary vessels of the fusion of the five elements practice that we've also talked about on this site. Um, the, the more energy that you're building up and the more pathways that it has, the more that it can flow into those other rivers, start to nourish your body. Um, so some of the practices um, that we've talked about, you can practice the ocean breathing, which are hands off to the sides and feel your sexual center, feel your, your testicles, or um, you know, if some women are watching the men's health video, feeling your ovaries expand. Just feeling that openness there. Um, a lot of times we've got closed off or contracted feelings around that uh, for whatever reason, you know, shame or guilt, or it's just, you know, it's our private parts. We don't share that, so it can be closed down. And um, certainly this may be the most uh, education um, some people have heard. I, I mean, I, I know that our government doesn't do a great job of teaching this. Public schools, there's a health class, but it doesn't get into the energetic or spiritual aspects of it. And, um, you know, church, um, 
uh, isn't isn't always the place to learn about this. So feel about the feel the ocean breathing. Uh, you could feel that expand. The iron shirt practice. Um, you may have learned that some standing postures. They really help ground this energy, and so that's really one of the major things that you want to do with this this very powerful sexual energy is feel it being grounded. Okay, it's when it's loose and out of control that um, it can harm us in our body or it can get us into trouble um, out in society. But we really want the uh, energy to be grounded and stable. So your iron shirt practice and feeling the energy breathing up and down from the sexual organs down into the earth and back up and down. And so in that way, really, you're making uh, the planet Earth your... Uh, your greatest partner, your lover here, because you're exchanging that sexual energy and pulling up the healing energy from the earth. Uh, the microcosmic orbit, um, it can be one of your greatest assets in working with this sexual energy. Uh, um, and uh, in combination with the sexual organ massage, uh, part of the Iron Shirt 3 practice that we've just discussed has to do with uh, massaging the glands, um, massaging the penis, massaging the glands of the testicles, and um, you can uh, massage the testicles with your palm, feel that energy heat up, and then run it through the microcosmic orbit. All right, it doesn't, all, it doesn't have to be a totally aroused feeling. Actually, I think it's better to work with the unaroused energy, just warming up the sexual organs, then circulating that around through the microcosmic orbit. That could be a, just a tremendous benefit in itself. Um, again, the inner smile, just embracing that aspect of yourself, smiling to it, uh, feeling the expansiveness of your sexual organs and that sexual energy um, can be a big benefit there. So try some of these practices. I mean, it's you know it may take a long time for you to uh, feel like you've really understand this practice, but in just a short amount of time, you could feel benefits and feel like you've got a choice. So instead of uh, just you know feeling like you're horny or feeling like you're um, confused about your sexual energy, you can start to draw it up and it can nourish your organs, and that's on day one. And then over time, you'll just start to develop it. And it's really, you'll start to have a feeling that all the energy that you ever needed is really inside of you. It's just a way of recycling it and using it more wisely. So thanks for your time. Send us an email, come train with us, uh, find a Healing Dow instructor near you, and start to work with these practices. And this may just be the one that changes your life uh, for the better. Thank you.